Welcome back to the Blunt Exchange. Oh. Fire. Cheer, cheer. Episode. 26, baby. Episode 26. Mm-hmm. Back at him. Mm-hmm. Doing great. I'm your host, Aim Gunner. Happy New Year, everybody. Happy New Year. Happy New Year. Cheer. Happy New Year. And to my left, I have the one, the only, none other than Crump. Woo! Yo, yo. A.K.A. Crump Diddy. Woo! How y'all doing, y'all doing out AKA there? A.K.A. Dexter. A.K.A. The oh, man. man. Yo, that's it. Oh. Uh. Wow. Sorry. A.K.A. Damn. Vibes. Serial Killy. Damn. A.K.A. William H. The all-time great. Mm. Uh. A.K.A. Paper over people. Damn. How you doing, my bad? Wow, man. This I'm is good, getting worse yeah, every good. week. Happy my guy, year, how everybody. are you doing? Happy New Year, everybody. Happy New Year. I'm chilling. I'm chilling. I'm good. I'm good. Here to kill it again. You ready to go crazy? Back to spar it up. Okay. Let's do it. Okay. Yeah. And to my right, uh-huh. I have the man, mm-hmm. the myth, mm-hmm. the legend, mm-hmm. Pablo, mm. a.k.a. Bleak, a.k.a. Made by Pablo. A.K.A. Wow. DJ Wavy <laughs> Seal. I'm not used to that one. A.K.A. I'm not letting no pussy pass me. Nah. I have to smash it because I'm that guy. Yeah. Get your ticket. Easy pass only. only. Mm. What are the subscriptions looking like right now? They're looking good, man. Holidays is in. Uh. Okay. Okay. Everybody wait for that stimulus. You getting them envelopes? I'm getting them envelopes. <laughs> you trying to get stimulated? <laughs> Hell yeah. Hell yeah, man. Shit. It's looking like we're going to get stimulated. I mean, Woo! Oh, yeah. Hopefully. I mean, yeah, it's looking like that, but we got some people on the other side that don't... Hating. What's hating. The, what does the other side mean? All right, let's move on Let's move that. on to you, my brother. Yeah, we don't talk about that. And I am your host once again, Abe Gutter, uh. a.k.a. Gregory Hines, the great dance legend. John, tap, tap, tap. A.k.a. Horsepower, Horsepower. Horsepower. A.k.a. Low Life, oh. a.k.a. <laughs> the Real Gunner. Guys, what's good? Ooh, I was your Walker. week, my brother. Didn't you teach Michael Jackson how to moonwalk? Tap, tap, tap. You know, I'll be dancing on the ceiling. Ooh. Um, how was your week, man? My week was excellent, well, but, I, you know, I chill with my son, which is always a pleasure. Ooh. And, um, guys, you want to go, what you want to do, straight word of the day, or then yeah, we, are we going it. off? Let's, go let's get it, day. man. We've been anybody, excited, anybody baby. Anybody wants to do a word of the day, or do I pick one of my words of the day? Yeah, pick, pick one of your words. Pick one of your words, man. Enlighten us. Word of the day. Word, word of, the of the day. Today's word of the day is hmm. pedantic. Pedantic. We did it. Yeah. For we did? sure. Yeah. We really. For sure. Pedantic. I don't remember. Or, or no, no, no. My bad. My bad. I, I just don't think so. That word so much in my vocabulary. Oh, so take the lead, oh, sir. My bad. Today's word of the day wow. is pedantic. Let's go. Pedantic. Any pedantic. guesses? No. Hey, picky. Nitpicky? Yeah, Nitpicky? Like, oh, like, choosy? Like, you like to, cho- you know? Choosy? Mm. Nitpicky? In my opinion, pedantic is nitpicky. Is it. What, what, like a picky person? Uh, you in did great. In conversational. You, you did great because even the definition, I should have looked at the definition before I picked the word. Oh. Because I know what it is, but you know what I mean? All right, yeah. so pedantic, right? Uh-huh. Pedantic, it says, it's an adjective of or like appended. Appendant. Pendant. Mm hmm. Mm-hmm. So, it's like tedious, like scrupulous, like extra. Yeah. Oh, the extra. You know, like, if it's a person, if you're describing a person, it's like a perfectionist, a meticulous person. Like, okay. You know what I mean? Nice. So, there you go. You know? But nitpicking is part, like, that's, you know it's what I mean? the same. Being extra, it's like mm-hmm. very, you know, precise, like extra. So, yeah. Okay. Choosy. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I'll give you that. Thank you, but yeah, so we'll do pe- better. Pedantic. If pedantic. something is a little pedantic, it's a little extra. Like, feel me? Yeah. Say they have a sentence right here. It says many of the essays are long, dense, and too pedantic to hold great appeal. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Tedious. Yeah, tedious. Like that definitely. five thousand page bill they send in. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? That Trump sent back. So why we ain't getting no? Why we ain't getting two racks though? Well, the House passed it. And uh, you already know our big our, our big boy over there in Kentucky, Senator McConnell. You know him. He's like, nah. 
He didn't even fight. He just he just rejected it. You think the people need two racks, or do you need two racks? Are you good? I'll take two racks. That'll help, or are you good? Yeah, that'll help. I don't know. Are, are we? The, are you the average person? Like, do you need that two racks? Yeah, it could help, right? Yeah, two I think so. Help. And if it don't I help, I feel like me, the average person they need that two racks. Everyone needs two racks. Yeah, I could definitely use the two racks. I'll take it. Everybody does. <laughs> so, anything happened crazy in social media this week? I think mad shit happened in social media. Uh, any what new all music these memes drop? that we went through? <laughs> we went through. Man. It's the end of the year. Are we gonna do any end of the year? Yeah, let's do a quick. Let's do a quick rundown. Let's do a real quick rundown. You sure? Yeah. You got him. I go. Yeah. What, let's what's, go. Your, what's everybody's what top three songs of the year? Top three songs of the year. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. For me or the top three songs of the First, year. First, no, for you, bro. Give me Obviously for me. You. But let's go yeah. through each of them, each person's personal one, and then we can talk about the song of the year, so, so, the quote unquote songs of the year. All right, throw me some names. Uh, for, body, for, adi, 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 uh, adi, adi, so adi. Do I don't fuck with no, that. No, no, give me your top three songs. All right, top okay. three songs of the year for me. Um, Roddy Rich, okay. The Box. Feel that. Okay. Um. Uh, little baby. Uh. Whoa. Nah. Nah, little baby had it. It's bigger than black and white song. Okay. What song is that? Um, the movement. Mm. Whatever Something song like that. that that is. Yeah. Uh, Chris Brown. <laughs> oh, it's not Chris Brown. Sorry. Chris Brown. Drake. Yeah. Oh, Drake. Chris Brown and Thug. Yeah. Uh, nah, nah, nah. Drake, Drake. Yeah. Uh, and. Fucking Lil Durk. No, no, oh, no, no. no. Uh, give me Pops. Give me. Uh. Hmm, pop some give me Popstar. Popstar is good money. Give me Popstar. Popstar is good money. I voted in for Popstar. What's your top three songs of the year? Oh, The Bigger Picture is. Uh, the, bigger the Bigger Picture. picture. Okay. The bigger Picture. All right. mm -hmm. Those are probably the top three songs of the year. Like, I mean, probably. What are your favorite three songs of the year? Favorite three songs of the year? Your top three songs of the year. Um, I'm going to go with Conejo Malo, mm -hmm. Balvin, La Canción. That's heat. Heat rock. That's for heat. The street rocks. For the street rocks. Oh, look at G. Got his phone on loud. Okay, no G. No respect. Okay, G. The money coming in. You know what I mean? Um, second song. Pro I'm going with Conejo Malo, too. La Perrea. Vos Perreo Sola. Okay. Mm. And Ooh. then the third one. No future? That's what I'm going. I'm thinking of some future. I know you're a super future fan. I am. Me and GR. Everyone's a super future fan. They just haven't accepted it yet. <laughs> uh, damn, I feel like that Drake desire, future that desire. I must have played that shit mm. like 500 times. Mm. So, I that. personally, I yeah. That. Yo, I feel like I, I was capping, but I get to be honest with you. Oh, oh yeah. I want to hear we, your song. Tap, tap, yeah. tap. Like, my songs is different, though. Like, yeah, I dance know, What are your like, favorite songs? Dance up, dance favorite up. favorite songs yeah. of the year. You put it on the people. Let's go. People want to know. If they listen to nah, G's playlist. I'm going to be honest with you. Dance. I feel like one of the best... I'm dancing right here. I feel like one of the best songs of the year <laughs> yeah. was Pop Smoke, Quavo, and Future Snitching. Snitching, okay. I love that song. You do love that song. Yeah, no. That was yeah, a great song. So that's a great song for that's you. That's a great song. Don't nothing wrong with that. A billion times. taking off. Bigger than black or white. Uh -huh. Okay. Bigger picture. That song is uh -huh. fire, though, but uh -huh. yeah. it banged for the whole so year. So what's, what's your third song, Bleak? It's re Oh, Desires, right? Yeah, yeah, okay. Desires. So, yeah, what were you So saying? my uh, top three songs was, damn, I love The Box. That shit was Ooh. fire. That yeah. got super played. Yeah. It's probably The Box, uh, <laughs> Pop Smoke Snitching. Pop Star? Damn, Pop Star. Damn, it's one of those Drake shits, bro. I yeah, know, man. Nigga Drake I, gave I us, like, four out. songs. Well, he gave us a mixtape, but then there's these four songs. Was it Grease? Chicago? <sighs> oh, Chicago? Oh, we'll give you out, right? What are the Drake shits? Any into James. And the third is what are the fire Drake shits that he dropped this year that burnt out Drake. my fucking Thanks, player. Jake. I feel that. Thank feel you, Aubrey. That. that burnt out my fucking MP3 space. That's what's up. Wait, That's you got an MP3? You, you got, got an MP3 player? Mine? Whatever. My what? fucking iTunes. Wait, you can't be this baked, bro. Not this early. For, We're about to go live. For me, go ahead. personally, yeah. I'd say some, my three favorite songs of the year, in no particular order, I'd say Lil Baby, either On Me or Living Off My Closet with Future off of his album, My Turn. Oh, my turn. God, yeah. this is fire. OD Fire. Yeah. Though, one of those baby songs. All right, I'll say, I'll, say, I'll say On Me, the new baby song, On okay. Me. Okay. Drake Grease. Yes, That good Grease one. song is OD Fire. OD. That beat is crazy. And then the last one, I'd say... Ah, uh, man. 
I know. I know. Yeah, it might be desires of Drake in future. Woo! Let's go! <laughs> you get desires? No, hold on. Yeah, we can't get yeah. copyrighted. Copyright. Yo, listen. Yeah. That well, verse. I should have moved you out of Texas before I copped you all that ice. Yeah. yeah. Yo, my nigga. You could have been my number one. So what are these top three songs of the year? Okay. Uh, um, I'm not changing. Man. No, it's like it's like Meg The Stallion. Yeah, Wops. it's like Meg The Stallion yeah. and Roddy Cardi Rich, B, the box. Roddy yeah, Rich, the, the box. box. And the what about baby. Roddy Rich and Pop Smoke? Was that didn't that go crazy? I don't like that song. That song was corny. Mm. Wow. She loves it with the. I know what you mean. Get out of here. I know what you mean. It's a super commercial song. Though. Yeah, it's wild. It's commercial. Super it, commercial. It sounds like forced. Yeah. Uh, it's something that he probably right, would have been like, nah. So what are your top? Shows. Top shows of the year. Any any new fire shows that are fire? Like TV shows? Yeah. yeah. New shit? I don't know. New shows. New shows come out. What new shit came out? Did well, Wu-Tang Connors this year? What is it? Top three albums of the year? Oh, top three albums? Roddy Rich's shit. Lil Baby shit. And, and, lo que me da la gana. and the uh, Thug and Chris Brown shit. Mm-hmm. Feel that. Yeah. That drink doesn't make it. He no. didn't drop an album. He that album tape. was like a, a that was like a it mixtape. Was a mixtape. Yeah. yeah, but I got a couple songs in the year. He did. No, I got some heat rocks on that. Hmm. I mean, he got seven joints. That shit with Favi was heat rock too. Favi, no, Demons. Oh, that song. Oh, okay, <laughs> come on, man. <laughs> Never yeah. made a movie with Drake. Nigga, we like Katie and Kyrie. Hmm. Nigga was talking crazy. Yeah. So um, all right. So top three albums. That's yeah. that, right? Yeah. Did you you agree with that or something? I drew with Rick, uh, with Roddy Rich, uh, Lil Baby, and mm. I don't know who's the third. Okay, and third. you had uh, Bad Bunny, Conejo Malo. Which the one? Way. All three of them. We were just putting that together. All three of his albums. He had yeah, a he hell of a three. fucking year, right? Yeah, he dropped three albums. Okay. Wow, wild man. All fire. All heat. It's insane. I can't he, believe it. Is he goaded? Yeah. He's up there now. He's already a legend. Yeah, if he died three today, albums. And if he died today, he's a myth. What do y'all say? They say they say that's a the fact. Industry says that Freddie Gibbs had the best album of the year. That's what they say. Freddie Gibbs is nice. Freddie Gibbs is nice. Wow. You know, but that's did why. You, did y'all? Did you? Do you like his album? Did you hear it? No, I didn't. No, I, didn't I can't it. comment. I did not listen to that. But album. every time I listen to Freddie Gibbs music, he's good. Um, like he's yeah. like he's spitting, he he's on beat. Like he doesn't, his voice is not trash. Like, not necessarily my favorite type right. of rap, but but he's nice. Future and Uzi tape. Yeah, that shit's banging, my nigga. Like I love that shit. I love the high energy, up tempo, like upbeat song of the year. Whoopty, Whoopty's not in there. <laughs> yeah, what's going? Is he allowed to even have that song? I see his shit be take, getting taken down. His name be changing. Like what's going on with that shit? I know. I know. I thought he got signed to uh, French Montana. All right, so he's good now. They're gonna fix that. You saw that new French that. Montana and Jim Jones record? No, I did not. Didn't didn't Frenchie drop a they album? The CB five or something? Yeah, French it, Montana it, dropped it, a new album. Yeah, Jim uh, French Montana and Jim Jones got a new song and a video where they like shut down the third. Uh, I think the Macombs Dam Bridge, in yeah. the Bronx, uh, Lincoln you, Harlem to the Bronx. Are they you, repping. Are they you repping. anticipating that, or have you? I saw have, it. Have you checked it I out? I it How'd out. you feel about that? It was cool. Yeah, they repping hard. What's wrong? School's wrong with repping the, the the greatest city in the world. Yeah. Come on, Jones. You feel me? Ain't nothing wrong with that. I New York you. City legend Jim Jones. You heard? I hear you. Who? At this point, they're both NYC legends. Max B. French and and yeah. um French is a legend in his own. In and in, in New York. You keep saying that. <laughs> we why just... are we talking about the wave god? <laughs> yeah, I don't know why. Oh. But yeah. Those two are considered, I feel, legends in New York. Any standout shows from this year? I know we've been inside the house a lot, quarantine. Maybe you've been binging any new shows, tried out any wow, new shows. This is true. Any any uh, shows this year that really stood out to you that you really uh, are really messing with? Yo, G, you got any right now? Because I'm trying to think. Uh, there's a few shows that I like this year. <clears throat> yeah. I'm trying to remember off the top of my head now right? because this is on the spot. Should have prepared Woo! for this. Um, this is good. This is good. Raised by Wolves was good. Okay. Did you enjoy that? I, I did not watch. The ending Ray was Bible. a fucking freak out, but it was good. Lovecraft Country. Did you enjoy that? I started that show, but I didn't finish it. Yeah, I haven't watched. That was it. fucking good. Um, Yo, yeah. Have y'all been watching the new Power Book Two? Have you watching the second listen, uh, Power? I, I had my doubts. I was skeptical about this because I really enjoyed Power and I didn't like the way it ended. Rest in peace, Ghost. But um, 
And don't listen, man. He's right there. If because you're dead now, because you're dead now, He's sitting here with us. Right don't now. start rapping. Stop rapping. We got to get him back on the power somehow as like a, a memory. As a ghost. As, yeah, as, as ghost. As the, the ghost, ghost of ghost. The ghost of The ghost ghost. Ooh, like that'll how, be great how everybody shit. started to come back and was ghost. Like, yeah, just get, get him a job that's not rapping. At this rapping. point, yeah, why not? Because Omari Hardwick, you suck at rapping, brother. I mean, you're not yeah. Rotini. Give it up. Hang so, it up. So power. Pack it up. You're so. not Rotini, right? That's his name? Rotini? 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 You're not him, Damn, bro. Damn, nigga said Rotini, my nigga. That's grime. <laughs> I didn't say so, that. Uh, violated so that So y'all liking Power? You liking the new season? Yo, bro, I'm loving it, man. A lot of people hate on Power. I feel like you just never watched it. Like, they just have their they, own... They have their own preconceived Yeah, notions. preconceived notions. They're not going to fuck with it. But Because it's entertaining. It's drama. It's like it's something for everything. It's for the women. Let me not even... Let me not even generalize anybody. For the people who love the drama yeah. and all the like relationship uh-huh. shit, mm-hmm. they got that for you. For the people who like the bang bang, shoot 'em up, kill a nigga dead shit, they got, they that. got that shit. Yeah. For that big money drug shit, they got that shit. People yeah, love who's that. Who's your favorite character from uh, this season? From this season? Yeah. It's going been going back and forth. Like I'm loving. I mm-hmm. was loving for a large part of this season. How Tariq is moving. I think he's he was growing up. I excused all his little mistakes because they were good learning, like, like you know what I mean? Like yeah, yeah. good lessons that he was learning. Mm-hmm. Right. So like I'm like, all right, good. He never he didn't really get too hurt. Okay. It was not too much skin, but he learned how to double money, make money, like go outside of the parameters to make money in a hurry. Like I was I was loving all of that. Okay. Starting to smash the Jones. Got a couple fire Jones to choose from. <laughs> Can we get a Mm. You want to talk about the girl? Who's the fireest joint on the show? Effie. Effie, wow, Effie Lauren, me. or D, right? It's yeah. Effie, then Lauren, then D. In oh. that order? Yeah, in that order. For uh, me. Wow. Uh, uh, fuck, Mary kill. Fuck, Mary kill, Bleak. <laughs> fuck, Mary kill? Yeah. <laughs> what the fuck is that? Who would you fuck? Who would you marry? Oh, who would, who would I kill? All right, thank you. <laughs> My bad is that. Uh, who would I fuck? Who would I marry? Who would I kill? I will definitely fuck the professor. No, no, out of the three, out of the oh, three, out of the three oh, my girls bad. for Tariq. Oh my bad, my bad. Yeah, I yeah. I, no, I would. So, I also Effin, know. Effin, I, would also, I, would, I would also. I would also fuck, fuck the professor. professor. Yeah, yeah. That was. Yeah, I agree with that. Thank you guys. I agree with that. But yeah, um, yeah Effin, com- it was consent with her consent, of course. Consent, boys. Damn, you, you definitely will marry the 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 joint he goes to school with, which okay. is Lauren. Which is Lauren. <laughs> definitely, you're gonna bang. F and, and then you know you need D because you gotta kill D. You gotta kill D. <laughs> it's Mary. Damn, but then you kill. gotta deal with mom. You gotta, gotta deal with the mom. I mean, I'm just saying you don't. Let's say you don't have to deal with the mom. No, that's nah, part you gotta deal with the mom. Part of it. Yeah, I mean, deal with the mom. Okay, you always gotta deal with the mom. Just off looks. I thought it was straight I, superficial. I thought just off looks. Just off looks. No actual. Just straight off looks. Yeah, just like that. Because I feel like if if actual comes into play, then Lauren has to get married. I mean, yeah. It's crazy. Yeah, just like that. Do you think that you want to kill uh, D because she's dark skinned? No, of course she's not. She's the dark skinned one. I said I had to deal with her moms, and that almost that made me. No, we eliminated that. that. But then you eliminated. We eliminated that. that so and I'm not she was still in last list. place. And they, I'm still not gonna change though. She's still in last place after you yeah. eliminated. She's still yeah. in the kill position. Is it because yeah. she's dark skinned? No, of course not. She's okay. caramel. She's got, beautiful. Why, why Will, is the black you, person? Why, Will, why, why, who who is your What is your order? I'm at. What is your order? I'm asking you. Easy way in. I get. Such me an and, easy way in it. So I, br- bring the camera you. on me. All right, go so ahead. I or, I answered it. Bleak, you, you answered it. I said, I said Effie. Oh, yeah, he, oh, 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 oh. No, exactly. but you didn't answer uh, the second exactly. question, which was So the, sorry, so I'm just, I'm asking you now. So Oh, but I asked you nah, first, but you, now yeah, you're gonna you, ask go me. Go ahead, Crumb, yeah. finish it off. All right, so um yeah, wow, it would be the same order. It would be the same order, right? Yeah. Shit. Ask him the same question. I mean, if am I if I'm me? Or if I'm Tariq. No, if I'm you. If you. If you. Yeah, you. same order. Same order. So fuck Effie, uh, marry Lauren, Lauren and kill yeah. D. Yeah. Okay. What about you? He's going to go the opposite. He's definitely going to marry D. He's going to kill Lauren. No, he's and then not. he's going to smash F him. I'm going to... No. Fuck Lauren. Wow. Marry D. Mm-hmm. And kill Effie. You see? Like, I'm sorry, Effie. In another world, I got you. Wow. Feel that? 
Got that. Let's go. That's what's up. So power, guys. Can we do some power talk? Finally, power talk. Power talk. Power talk. Have talk. you caught up? Why are we so caught what's up? What's going on? Why are we so up. quiet? What's up with the energy yeah, in the pod? Niggas is high. I'm ready for yeah. power talk. I'm Niggas ready is for blasted. Niggas is mad high. Niggas but is high as shit so, on the pod. What the so what, fuck is going on? So what you think about Kane? That's Don't two. you ever mention Kane? Nah, that's, that's my, my dude. Nigga, that's my dude. That's my favorite. Yo, since I the understand. Beginning. He's a stupid nigga, but I, Yo, he's mad but I love dumb. him. He's like Yo, my he's stupid. He's not nigga. stupid. He's mad dumb. You're a he's dumb not. ass nigga. No, he's not. No, he's but not. you're no, my dumb ass nigga. But he's not a dumb ass nigga. He's dumb as shit. Dumb he's not a dumb. He's, he's dumb. Muscle. No, he's not a dumb Kane muscle. He's a dumb ass. He's not a dumb muscle. He's making mistakes based on other things. He's mad emotional. It's it's hard. It's hard. Like the 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 hothead dumb muscle, like they got to be the middle child, in my opinion. Mm. If they're the oldest and they're the hothead dumbass that just is just gun toting, ready to just go to war, yeah, they're gonna feel like it's their job to run the the, the family, but they're not smart enough to run the family. He's smart enough. Though. No, he's not. He is. You got if, it. And if and if and if <laughs> the hothead is the youngest, yeah, they're gonna be. If the hothead is the youngest, they're gonna be too wild to really control when they need to just have them chill out. So the hothead needs to be the middle child. Bleak. That's that's a little. They're scared. Of, they're not really. The, there's no pressure on the oldest, and they're the middle. Wow. Bleak. What gives you the impression yeah. from everything that you've seen on this show that Kane is smart enough to run the business? Because you said that you think he could. He's because smart he's enough. smart enough to do what he's been doing so far. But the only thing that fucks but he's all, Kane but up. But he's been doing nothing but dumb shit. But because his decisions have been made based on emotion. He's hurt and he feels like Tariq is, you know, is threatening him on his position in the family. You feel me? So then now I mean, but it, those he, decisions but Tariq are, actually are isn't. Tariq actually isn't trying to do that. So that's exactly. why he's so dumb. No, he's not dumb. He's just caught up in his feelings. Mm. It's two different things. Okay. So that makes him dumb. That doesn't make him dumb. That makes him a younger Tariq. Tariq season one, it was doing a the younger exact, Tariq. Yes, but he's, Tariq season one. How are you was doing older than me and still a little nigga? But that's just based on experience and, what, and how you handle things. Obviously, Tariq has been through some different kind of drama that, is, that has specifically given him tools to deal with this kind of drama that he's dealing with right now. That's why he's been maneuvering the way he is. But last season, he was not. Because his decisions in last season were based on emotion, on the shit that his dad and stuff like that. So that's why his shit was all fucked up. Yo, I feel like I give uh, Tariq more of a pass than anything because... I understand where he was coming from. He was trying to protect his family and himself. Like, his dad threw him under the bus type shit. Mm -hmm. And honestly, I feel like all the negative shit came from his dad anyway. So, like... So he thinks. So when his dad was like, nah, man, you just do the bid. I got you. I'll be in charge. So he thinks. Relax. Because it's, like, his, mom that's, here, it's his mom that's sending him to do shit. It was it, never St. Patrick. I never. Like, listen, man. But go ahead. He was just riding with his moms because but he his felt moms like his dad the one betrayed his moms. Him. He's fucking some other bitch. I mean, like you feel me? I, like he's, you know what I mean? Like fuck this nigga. If I may, oh, I'm gonna give you a good you comparison. May. The same, the same mama issues that Tariq was going through in the first season is the same mama issues that Kane is going through now with his mom. It's the exact same thing. You didn't see what she yelled at him in the last episode at the hospital when she walked away from him. Yeah. What did he say to her? He said, Mom, you uh You made me like you this. You made me like this. What does what did Tariq repeat to his mom all the time? Oh. Uh. <laughs> I mean You feel like you did something right there? I'm just saying, I'm just giving you, you Respect. know, connecting I mean, dots. Hey, that was I'm fire. just connecting dots I mean, for you and sounded, giving you and giving you some substantial you know evidence on why I feel that way. I mean, listen. Give you some facts. It, it, okay. It was substantial. look, it was substantial. Mm -hmm. I respect it. Okay. Um but yeah, that nigga's a dumbass. Tariq did some immature, selfish ass shit. Just like. Him. And we can consider it dumb, but all that shit worked out for him. Like, the, the, all the plays worked. They well, hit. We haven't seen the ending like, yet. So, you we know, don't know what yet. I mean, he has a whole nother, he has his own show. Okay. He's, the place is working. <laughs> and the shit is hitting. This kid could get I, his own show. I think show they want to have another season. I think they want to have another season. So, I think, he yeah, did, I think nah, his shit it's, is hitting. It's. it's it's a good ass season, yo. Oh, the good. boy that went, that that uh, Kane sent to kill him was. Oh, the hold on, worst. are we spoiler alert? Uh, spoiler alert! I mean, that's a we spoiler we just started alert. Talking I mean, about that, it. That, that happened two weeks two weeks ago, though. All right, all I'm right. saying we just started talking about it. Oh right. well, I mean, spoiler alert! Spoiler, spoiler alert! alert spoiler alert! All right, go ahead. Kane sent uh, so Kane sent um, somebody to kill uh, Tariq, and he was the worst worst hitman I've ever seen in my life. Yeah, absolutely. Tariq. 
like out muscle you. Well, he almost had him. You had, you know, I know, obviously he had to be light. Out. He had to yeah. move. He had yes. to move light. I mean, he's, he's, like, he's in a car. Mad, he was mad obvious with mad the tail. Obvious. Mad he's obvious. Like, yo, get back here, yo. Nah, I thought it was wild that like. Tariq immediately noticed him. Was it the off-white kicks? Was it yep. Like, yeah. What was yeah. it? Like, oh, exactly. shit. Nobody has off-whites yeah. in school. Like, what kind of stupid Europe. shit? Yeah. Yeah. I mean, of course I niggas that. have off-whites. Nah. nah, I feel that. Nah, that was good. That. that was good observation, That's by That's good observation. I feel Great that. observation, man. That shit was mad fake to me. Like, I mean, what? it was an obvious... It was a super... Out of place, yo, out no, of place it, it was. It was a, it's supposed... It's an obvious... It's supposed to be representation that, yo... Like mm-hmm. Tariq knows the people that go here. Don't the niggas wear that. that go there don't get fresh like yeah, that. Yeah, he goes to Stanford. And you have lime green ones. It's yeah. not that you're wearing just wearing off white kicks. You're wearing yeah, lime, lime green, green off white kicks. Yeah, nah, you don't belong here. You bro. stand out a little bit. Yeah, you're not you supposed know, to. You don't. You don't. You don't. You Frank don't pick Lucas up on stuff like that. that when you uh, when you might be moving around. Yeah, Frank L- Lucas told you us be that. Picking up on uh, nah, I'm, I'm very cues. I'm very aware. Like yeah, that's what my observational skills is on crazy, and I do be checking. What's going on? You know what I mean? The surroundings, making sure everything is going Can't good. Can't be the most obvious person in the room. But I didn't think that that off-white, neon off-white was an automatic tell. Like, oh, this nigga's about to kill me. Like, what? You okay. Think, uh, oh, that nigga got neon green off-whites? Let me get the fuck out of here. I mean, I'm I'm paying attention to, to it. This yeah. is the second time I'm seeing it. Yep. Okay. Man, man, follow the story, man. Yeah. You think... Uh, I. Do you think or hope uh, Two Bit eventually starts working with Tariq instead of just extorting him? How long do you think this extortion is gonna? Uh, Until Tariq happen? decides to take care like, of it. I think there hasn't been a lot of uh, uh, murders or uh-huh. graphic killings uh-huh. of, it, of some sort. Like I just feel like there hasn't been any yet. So, I mean, I mean, I feel Kane like popped give us... those dudes when he went into the, and oh, then yeah. they chopped up the body to start yes, this, they did. this. This is like I thought that was I thought that was a little ridiculous to me. When they started the episode with them on some Breaking Bad, chopping up the bodies, Chop up putting the them bodies. in the, in the but barrels that's how he does put it. like the, the acid in it. I think that was like, to show. To me, I think that was to show that Kane is like unhinged. Like, but I, I feel that, but he's not smart he loves enough. It. In my opinion, he he's not. Killing. He's not no, that he's type just, of criminal to have the knowledge to to get that kind of shit. No, he's just done it so many like, times. He, he's yeah, just, and he loves to it. To me, he's just the type of dude who's we shoot him, kill him, and we get out of there. Nah, he we don't we don't we don't chop up the bodies and put him in the cleans up. But they've uh, always done I, they, that. They, in my opinion, they haven't showed us anything that would prove that. I think he's so. He's just shown to be a fuck up. Kane nah. has just been nah, proven but to be a fuck up. But he, but they, That's like, in the last few episodes. episodes. I mean, this ho- we've only known him this season, and he's no, only shown even in the episode, to be a fuck up. Crump, crump, crump. First episode, crump. he was getting top from the dude from the dude's girl, and then made the made it while hot at the party. Yeah, they he's made you been a hot boy. Nah, bro, they Yo, just giving you that cool. light of him. Come on, you know. Even on the episodes, they say like the Monet says shit like. Yo, you know Kane is in charge of the re-up. That's like the most important shit. I yeah, mean, he's bro. muscle. He's in charge he's of that muscle. shit. They're scared yeah, of him. Because, so he's, he's mad important. So he's mad important. He's very I, important. I'm not saying he's not important. I'm saying he's not smart. <laughs> to 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 to, you, to chop up the body. Do you agree? To chop up him you, and the other dude from GTG. The, the little you, ski ski. Little beat. flip nigga. Yeah, do, yeah, do yeah, yeah. Do you agree? Do you agree? Kevin Ubre nigga. Yeah. Do you agree that there's more than one type of intelligence? Yeah, I, I'm saying he's not that okay. type of intelligent. I think he's a killing intelligent. I mean, like, he's a no, he's, he's a, a he's a he's a hoodie, going he's, hoodie intelligent. No, 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 he's the type of intelligent. Man. He's the type of intelligent where you tell him to run into the building and shoot up everybody, and he's like, hell yeah, let's do it. He's that type of intelligent where he's wow. a dumbass. Wow, that's so crazy. I can't believe y'all think like that. Y'all see that in that character. Oh, <laughs> It's so hard, right? Like they're That's telling OD. Kane, they're telling That's Kane, OD. yo, go in there and kill them niggas. And if he dies, oh well, he was only the shooter. He's the shooter and the bodyguard. Come on, the shooter and <laughs> play the your body. part. He's oh, your brother, man. though. I'm, I'm not saying he's. I'm, I'm. He plays he's his part. Friend. He doesn't deserve to be leading the the the, the family eventually. So he who do you think? Back. Who do you think should? Um, Drew. <laughs> Drew. I knew y'all. Why? Because he's smart. Yeah, he took he 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 put himself in the line of fire when it came to saving saving his, his cousin, yeah. who's who's led who's, who's supposed to be going to the NBA, and he, and making, he didn't snitch. That was, was the one good. move he did, and that's it. No, no, no. He I was mean, making good that decisions. That was the one move he did, and that's it. No, no. He was making mad good I mean, decisions. He was playing mad good poli- yeah. politic decisions, too. Yeah. Like, yo, shut up about decisions. certain yeah. shit. Take the blame for shit that he didn't have to take the blame for to keep certain shit quiet. Like, right. he was making good moves. Like, he's right. intelligent. Okay, he's we'll see. He's playing the game. We'll see. What do you think about um, uh, Method Man now? 
Method Man is a great actor. I've seen the resurgence of Method Man. Uh, the whole resurgence. Love, the hoes love Method Man now. They said that this is I the think best they've always Method had. Man has ever looked. Yeah, did you see? Uh, I yeah. don't think and it's now, never stopped. And now they all want to smash Method Man. I think it's never stopped. I'm, I'm, Shout out to you, yeah. Meth. I'm saying when it comes to shout out to you, the hoes is on it. When it comes to his character and the predicament he's currently in, he's a piece of shit. No, he's How you not. gonna try to send a black nigga to jail? I feel like you should just get Tasha out and then screw Sax. Like fuck Sax. Uh, too late. Too late bitch. for that. Too late nah, for he wanted. Is it too late now? I mean, they got the pictures of you, so he could just. He's like, yeah, I'm just. But, but how does the like? I know the pictures are bad you because it sounds us. like you were talking Look, to. He's the people. working with us, and we got the pictures. You control the narrative. Yeah, but they can also crap out him out too, and just have him talking to the witness, and she's gone. Yeah, Basically, that's, that's what they show. Like that's what I'm saying. Yeah. That's what I thought they were gonna do. Yeah. But anyway, that's true. Um. Like, I don't think that's enough for him to, like, you know what I mean? Like, it's over. Like, he can still, he can explain that. She's not dead. I mean, yeah, he's a Tariq didn't he kill her. Away. Yeah. I mean, she's in the wind. Yeah, he just gave her some money to stay low for a while. Just no, not stay for a while. Low. Get out of here. You're, you're just starting a new life. Somewhere else. I don't start think he gave her enough money. He said he, he probably gave her 20 he, racks. He said, like, I mean, I 20 racks. I mean, 20 racks and I can get the fuck I mean, out of here. Yeah, that, that's, what, how much more you it want? It was more than that. It was you get 20 racks and you get out of here. 20 racks to start a new life? I mean, it had to be more than twenty racks. Yeah, not enough to start a new life. But, but it no, was she more. asked. I'm not saying you have to change her name. I feel like she name. asked for exactly. She didn't have to amount, change her name, like, and it wasn't even nothing crazy. She don't have like, to change her name. She just has to move to some to random Carolina. place. Yeah, you have twenty racks. You can get a house. You're a stripper. Go strip and have the house. <laughs> Basically, capitalism. I mean, that's a down payment on a crib. Down south houses is cheap. Not but, anymore, man. Niggas live there. Now. I mean, you, but everyone you can, moved down there. Just, you, everyone heard that. But I wasn't surprised that he did that move. Yeah. I was not surprised by that move. Yeah, I, yeah. I thought he was gonna kill her at first. Nah, and then, I, and I then she said the thing, and I was like, oh, he's gonna pay the guap, like a dummy. <laughs> nah, bro. <laughs> Paying the money he's... like a dumb dumb. Yeah. Shit, just body that hoe. First time she does it. Should have just kicked her out of there. Get out of here. Should have just killed her. Yo. Should have just pulled the sh- beat it, bitch. Should have pulled the gun, burn on her, and say, "If you don't get out of here, here's here's two thousand dollars. If you don't get out of here here's- and never come back, I'm no. killing your baby." <laughs> Sheesh. Here's two hundred dollars and some plane tickets. Wow. All right, keep it light. You heard, nah, Shorty? He gave her some guac. He gave her at least fifty. Or he gave her twenty five. Give her twenty five. Yeah, because that was uh, that was at least twenty to twenty five. That was uh. That was the the lawyer's fee for the whatever. Yeah. Twenty five. Yo, I, I, I thought short. she asked for something mad light, like ten racks or twenty racks. You like, feel you feel Tariq kept it. She's like, all I need is twenty racks and I'm good. I can get the fuck out of here. You feel Tariq kept it pretty G when he was when he told the uh the lawyer, but, yeah, I killed my pops. You know what I mean? Yeah, he I don't know. I had to. Yeah, I feel like he has a plan. When a woman is fe- fed war. up, like a woman scorn, what they say, there's no wrath like a woman scorn, something like that. If she's tight. She's gonna bring that nigga the fuck down. Like, Who, the lawyer? To the, yeah, to the ground. He's, she's gonna burn that nigga. I mean, he has a little, he has a client privilege. Yeah, yeah, but she can. Okay, she not she can't say anything that she directly knows, but she can use her knowledge oh. to help influence a case or whatever. Basically. You know, build a case or break a case or whatever. I'm Basically, not a lawyer. she got to do. I don't deal with the boys, but <laughs> I don't deal with the boys. All right. I mean, I, I try and stay as informed as possible. I'm just. Mm-hmm. I was all jokes. <laughs> Education. No, I respect smart. you. I respect you, man. Fuck. F- what are you, what are, you try- are you trying to say? Are you trying to say fuck the police? Is that what you're saying? How about the How about the professor? Man, I just don't, I mean, who said you saying defund the police? <laughs> uh, yeah. Did you? Is that what you're saying? No. Oh, okay. No my, Republican my G. No, I'm just I'm just asking. Uh, how about the professor? How do you think he's dealing with the situation? Of knowing that somebody else is banging oh, his yeah, joint. Oh yeah, yeah. What do you? Yeah, what do you? What are your thoughts on he's the professor? Wilding. Both professors and all that kind of stuff. Yo, so um, yeah. But another aspect of the uh, show too, I wanted to talk about is how do you guys feel about the uh, the professor characters? They're mad interesting uh, and a lot of people extremely. Are talking about no, I hate. Yeah, I, man. Mad people be shitting on them. Yeah, um, like and as they should for in some cases. Yeah, I, I think the guy's a scumbag. He is the weirdest, most wow. cringiest, most piece yeah. of shit, wow. douchebaggiest. Yeah. He looks like, like a, creep he looks like a monster. Bizar- Bizarro Morris Chestnut. Like, oh, Bizarro. Sheesh, like opposite. Like, he looks wow, like, a like evil, like look. evil Morris Chestnut. Yeah. Evil. Yeah. Damn. Yeah. You can't even say that. But the word. um, uh, I don't, I don't really, I don't mess with him. 
I feel he's a scumbag. Okay. I, I think he's up to no good with him finding out about uh, course correct and and, and sorry. Yeah, but why are you skipping that. the most disgusting, creepiest, slimiest part of him? Besides the fact that he's manipulating her for sex because he knows she's she has an issue. Yeah. And taking advantage of all the women that it seems that every woman that he has sex with, I feel like he has a creepy dynamic with them, yeah. and it seems disgusting. Like, he's like not consent besides boys. that, he's okay. not consent boys. He's not consent boys sponsored or approved whatsoever. Okay. Wow. But besides that. You didn't even mention that. Okay. It seems like his first book was basically a uh, expose on his relationship with Shorty. Yes. And it feels like he did a gr- her grime, like he was he yeah, just he did, did a tell all type yeah. shit, like without her consent once yeah. again. Yeah. And the shit that and and since then he's been in a drought of writing mad whack shit, and now he's just stealing Tariq's work to yeah. make his new shit and like watching Tariq's life to like get all his inspiration. Like he's like a fucking witch. Yeah, right. Not even like a nigga, not a warlock, because a warlock sounds cool and man and masculine and manly. This, damn, I'm not saying women are awesome. We're twenty twenty years old. Twenty twenty. He sounds like a bitch. A warlock, yeah. Like a witch. Like a witch. A like bitch. not a warlock or a wizard or whatever. Or yeah. Evil wizard. A bitch. Creepy nigga. Super creepy. So yeah, um, he's a scumbag. He's a. How do you feel about him, Bleak? Oh yeah, oh you. you no, no, yeah, finish. Uh, no, no, finish it off. Oh, you uh, yeah, so I think he's a scumbag. Mm-hmm. Uh, like he's he's forcing Tariq to write his book, but unbeknownst to him, and yeah, he's right? using his life. Isn't that so disgusting? Yeah, yeah. that shit is nasty, bro. That's like a. Dis- it's just it feels so weird. Yeah. yeah, he's 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 truly 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 uh, a horrible horrible person, and uh, <laughs> but he somehow gets the ladies though. Yeah, wow. <laughs> The, that, teacher mean, assist, hey. that teacher assistant was pretty hot. That, pretty. Um, all his joints is hot. Yo, yeah. she was... And, all his and, and that hot. was... All come on. That hot. wasn't good professional. Yeah, that yeah. wasn't professional. That, wasn't that was... Taking okay. advantage of a... Unethical. A student. Um, you think he yeah. was? An aid, student aid. Yeah. Wow, okay. So, um, That's like a power dynamic. That that should be like... Yeah, I don't think that you, I think you can do that. He's completely off with all his stuff. And then he, he trailed Tariq and all that. So, yeah. like, I don't mess with him. Truly don't mess with him. How do we feel about the lady professor? What's her name? Milgram? I don't know. Bleak, Professor Milgram? Bleak, you started off on the lady. How do you feel about Professor Milgram? I think... I know earlier you said you would you would uh, like to... Oh, yeah, she's the baddest. Her, uh, yeah, she's extend the baddest her on the show. free subscription to the Personally. Easy Pass. To me, she's the baddest on the show, to me, personal. The baddest on the show? On the show, yeah. Without the, the professor, yeah. We're whole, the whole character, everything. Better than Lauren. You know, the the, the advisor, than, the she's college she's student advisor. Bad, she's better than the female you know, cop? Pro, she's a prosecutor. She's better than the female she's cop? Bad. Than the female cop. Then who? The Angela? <laughs> No, not Angela. Oh. Uh, the one that helped two bit. The one that yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Paola? She's too, she's yeah. <laughs> she's bad That's... though, but this one took the this one took the crown. <laughs> she took the crown, but um, nah, I think she's. But to just to, to comment a little bit on the on the professor on the dude. Wow, that's that's come back shit what he did to Tariq, right with the whole yeah. writing. But the man has all the emotional. Like <laughs> baggage, not baggage, but like he's one of those like people that when they lose control or something, right? They do whatever. Like he's so lost in his his yeah. ego and his shit that yeah, he's so far he's, 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 he's so far he's, gone. He's in too deep. He's so in too deep that he lost control of that girl. That it yeah. forced him to think that this kid is smashing. He's not even in reality. That anymore. is not even. Yeah, he made up the whole shit, bro. Yeah. And then yo, why are you sleeping that. with Tariq, yo? What? Yo, yeah, to so do how that, do you... to write that, to go to the extreme and to write that, knowing that if that shit gets out, you're ruined. Like that's OD. That's someone blinded by. Yeah. Have you ever emotion. been? Have you ever been so thirst and blinded by like a shorty? Like even in the early days, like yeah. she was so bad. Like yo, who the fuck is she talking to? Let yeah. me see your phone. No. Nah. <laughs> yeah. That's why Tariq is winning through all huh? this. No. Nah. I've never, I've never done that. You ever had a bitch that like always on your neck, like calling you all the time? Like, if you don't pick up, I call you again. If you don't pick up again, I FaceTime you. Yeah, I've been, I've been, I, I pick pretty cool one. So you've never been I clingy, pick, and you've never had a clingy shorty. Uh, nah, not overly clingy. Not past normal woman cling, clingy. <laughs> what does that mean? I mean, bleak. You ever had a clingy I mean, yeah, that's situation? Not, that's not yes, I've had a clingy situation. You've never had a clingy situation at all? I've really never had it. Not not where not one where it ever became like a problem. 
Yeah, man. Every, Yo, everyone any, has nobody. That. Nobody's had a studio? cleaning Anybody situation. Has. Anybody oh, has I've studio? had a cleaning situation. So what's your cleaning situation? Your cleaning? Little cleaning situation. It. So in a in, in a cleaning situation, in a cleaning situation, like. When does it become clingy? Because I know at the beginning, it that's got to be fire. Someone's loving all I mean, on yeah, you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like I said, it's never, been, it's never got to a point where it was a problem. When does it get clingy? First time you got to... Remember you have to do that when somebody's name pop up? Okay, so well, the first time you look at their name and you're like, Ugh. And you want to just bang on it. The first time you want to uh, bang on the phone call. But that happens to everybody. Sometimes your mom calls you and you're like that. Never. So what does that mean? Never, mom. Oh. oh. <laughs> Do we have issues here? No, nah, man. man. <laughs> the, even even with my mom, sometimes it's like, Ugh, all right. SVU. What happened on SVU? <laughs> you know what SVU's I mean? heat, man. Let her live. Nah. Nah, but I think we've seen them. The, I feel like I feel like we've yeah. seen these before. Yeah, we have. Yeah. So you've never clingy relationship? I've had. Okay, I've had. Clingy. I've had. Um. Let's talk about yeah. it. I've had a few. When does it I become think. clingy? When does it become clingy? Because at first it's got to be beautiful. That's got to be love. Well, when the space, then, then when there's no space, right? When it's just squeezing. When you're squeezing that person. And and then do you feel like that's your responsibility? Your responsibility as soon as that happens to be like, listen, this is not working out for me? Of course. Why do you stay with the clingy shit? Of course. Because it's hard, obviously, to get out of that situation. But isn't the clingy shit like like because shorty, that means like a shorty's like catering to you? No, it depends. You see, she's that's also going to be like she's also going to be demanding of your time. Now you do, now attention. you have like subdivisions of this clingy. Because okay, we're so what, is, cling, what does clingy mean to you? That clingy means someone who just is incoherent of your time and completely doesn't pay attention to that. It's just once you know, and just you can't get rid of them. But why That's would you want to get rid of the person you're fucking with? Because you also need your own time. I believe that so every you can person have your own needs time. Hey, I, have, I need my own time, sure. Yeah, but that person doesn't allow that. Okay. And if he and if you ask for that, then they create a problem, and then they attach that to whatever the fuck they want to. And you're not fucking with that. No. Hell, the fuck no. How long? How long will it take for you to recognize the clingy and get the fuck out of there? Oh, that takes like two months, two to three months. Because the clingy can also be amazing, right? I that's mean, what I'm saying. What, means, what could be beneficial about someone that's clingy? The clingy, I feel like the clingy would be like a most giving and generous lover. Are you talking about clingy yeah, on the like, basic side of it? Yeah, or are you like talking about to where it's like almost annoying. Exactly. The word is clingy, so clingy to me, I feel like it's overly whatever it is. It's overly it's affectionate, okay. overly like wanting your attention in time. Uh, I think from time to time it's cool, but not on a consistent basis. Yeah, but then how can you separate it? How can you tell them to stop? Yeah, so what's the line? Is it just because she's not attractive enough, or is it just because she's no, not? No, that's different. Like, what is it? I mean, because if like I'm telling you, if it's a Rihanna, she can. Is how long is it going to take for Rihanna to be too clingy? Six, seven years? No, but, it could but be the three shorty months. It takes two months. It could be three months too for Rihanna. If yeah. Rihanna, if Rihanna's clingy, you're out of there in two months. In three months, in two months, yeah, bro. If you can't handle, if Rihanna is clingy on you. And you're not fucking with her like that. You're out of there in two months. I mean... This sounds like some fucking bullshit. That nigga's right. just capping. Okay, what would you do then? Cap. You I stay mean, with if it? it? If, it was, if it was to the point where it was negatively affecting something, then... No, what, end... what can Rihanna being clingy on your dick be negatively? Like, I wow, mean, what's the negative effect of that? You and so explain to me. So you, you said, explain come to me. Come on, man. Rihanna's not even... Clingy, come on, man. Explain to me you the negative the, effect. You said the, word, you said the word itself, clingy, is a negative thing. Exactly. I, th- I thought it was a, a range. I thought there was a like a a, a, a scale. Like, I mean, She's like, clingy. It's but, annoying. So come on. I mean, man. yeah. Like, I'm saying whoever it is. You act like like pe- you act like Can't these people Rihanna, don't get broken man. up with all the time. Like people. I'm people, saying, would you break up with Rihanna though, or are you gonna be <clears throat> feast off the benefits and the and the pure sexuality <clears throat> and and flawless beauty that is Rihanna? I mean, once it, once it becomes to a point where it doesn't outweigh the, the, the negative, outweighs the positive, then I'll end it then. But I'm not gonna just stay in it just for the notoriety and the fame. Get him. There you go. I'm not even worried about the notoriety or the fame. Oh, the riches, the riches, and her and her pure beauty isn't enough for is me. Is enough? Got is, it. Saying, and the riches. Is, saying, isn't, is, is enough for you to just be in a uh, bad relationship? I will deal with her clinginess. For how long? For uh, yeah, but until, we're not talking forever, man. Until you gotta be realistic. Until I get the aim gunner fund all, she, like up and you? running to the place I need it to be. Uh, nah, man. Be you, realistic. You, you, you feel you're gonna get money during. Just because you Gunner Towers. Come to Gunner Towers. 
I have my own Gunner Towers. It would be a hotel slash barbecue spot. The barbecue is on the first floor, but there's a hotel on the top over it. Cool. Yeah, no? Hey, man. Hey, that's what you want to do. Yeah, bro. You, you just made up some shit up about Rihanna, so that's, Rihanna you know what I mean? But if in reality, you wouldn't, t- you wouldn't do on, that. Come on, who would want to have a barbecue spot and then you just go lay down after you eat all that barbecue, all that ribs? Just go lay down. No. Nah, right. Some people, probably, a lot of people probably would. <laughs> you, I'm sure. You bet your ass they would. I'm sure. I mean, I'm sure that people would, <laughs> would also just eat it and go home. <laughs> <laughs> that's good, too. That works for us. Anyway, moving on. Shit, man. Any, any user Slapped. question? Any user? Uh, I mean, not user questions. Uh, Bro, man, I had some fire through. ass fucking questions. I can't remember none of them just right now. Mm. Uh, something about. Uh oh. Oh. Mm. Okay. Mm. If um, mm-hmm. if uh, okay. User question. Uh huh. See if I can set it up right if I remember it correctly. You're married now, right? Okay. Your man's wants to fuck with your ex, OD. You good with it? Yeah, I don't care. <laughs> you're married now. Your man wants to fuck your ex. It's like the one that you. Like how long with. we were together? Like, like your, like your, the ex, the like, seven year joint, the five year, whatever um, that is, the other, wow. one, the other one. Wow. He's like, yo, man, we just clicked, like, you know, just on the low, it. we kind of bonded over you, nigga, because you remember oh. you was grounding me, like, a couple years yo, ago. Man, get out of my face, Like, man. but to be I mean, real, to I'm be gonna, real. I'm going to be like, yo, do you, but. Yeah, man, I'm get just, out of my I'm, face. I'm, I'm like, yo, do you, but, damn, that you a get bird? I'm going to probably call you a bird. Yo, get but, out of my yo, face. Yo, my nigga, come on. Probably call you a bird. She's different now. I'll probably call you a bird. She's a different, she's a different bitch now. Yeah, I'm going to probably call you a bird. She was different with you. With me, she different. I'm going to be like, yo, you can do whatever you want. Yeah. I need the last. Thank you, bro. With me, she different, you heard? Nah. Her real self coming out. Get out of my out. face with that. Yeah. Get out of my face with that. You coming to me with that shit? I mean, we bonded over How you feel about shit. that, Bleak? Get the fuck out of here. I mean, my man isn't talking to me like that. So. Yeah, get out of here. Like, okay, we what part was disrespectful? Let me clean it up. What the fuck does that even thing. mean? Like, yo, bro. I... You heard anything. I didn't hear nothing, dog. <laughs> yeah. I didn't hear shit. <laughs> yo, bro. Nah. I just want to talk to you about something. Okay, cool. Holla at me. All right, yo. Yeah, yeah, you remember your yeah. ex? Which one? The one, you know, the other one. Uh-huh. Me and her been kicking it, and we on some real good vibes, and I'm, I'm about to wife that. Are you good with that? I mean, you don't, you're already about, you're already about to wife it. Like, I really, I really, I want to wanna wife it, but I want your blessings. Uh-huh. I want Man, you to be cool, I want you here. to be cool uh, with it. I mean, you don't, you, you don't need to, you, this, Clearly, you're already at a point where you don't need any kind of conversation. No, I need you me. to be cool with it. You don't need anything from me at this point. Nah, if I, w- I want to yeah, go how public, y- I want to. How many dates y'all been on? How many I want to go public. Y'all smashed shit. already? Damn. damn. Like, I- I'll tell you if you really want to know, my nigga, but do you feel like you should be asking me that? I mean, I mean, you're asking me a question. After I'm asking you, can you be you're cool doing- with it? I'm trying to mash and and go public with your ex. Like, we f- we vibe. Like, it's. It's 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 an, it has nothing to do with the 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 girl. It has nothing to do with her. I, I could I could care less. Yeah. So then, what is the problem? I mean, I'm talking to you, I'm, and, and I'm ta- listening and to you. You're doing anything. You, you did something before talking to me at all. You should have talked to me before anything. Oh, so I could so I couldn't even like talking to her. Like, if she came up to me and she popped up with me in the in the wherever we were at, uh-huh. and she was like, "Yo, let's chill, let's kick it." We rolled the L. We smoked. Oh, you took a few steps and party she together? smashed you me. Happen to yeah. Be, you happen to be at a party. Or or something like get together <sighs> and we chill because we know each other. We smoked and she smashed me. What at the party? <laughs> like right after the fucking uh, party. Oh, uh, if you're my man, you, sh- you should have just hit me with the text. Yo, your 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 ex wants to smash me. your ex yeah. and me are smoking. Oh fire! Because it was like a flash smash. Oh, like she cool. smashed me out of nowhere. That's cool. Like I mean, you feel like, smashed. Like, oh, we we happen to be at the same mutual friend party. Like, yeah, something like that. Yeah. Oh, that's cool. That's what's and up. like that's we know each other. Like, yo, yeah, you want to smoke? Nah. You want to go smoke? Oh, we went yeah. to the other room, and and next thing I know, nah. she's topping I'm me. Good. Oh, next thing you know, she's next thing I know, me. she's topping me. Oh, that, that's yo, amazing. Don't front, yo. You see, don't front like that doesn't happen. <laughs> Bleak, oh. come on, be honest. Bleak. <laughs> oh, she's oh she's topping me. Bleak, oh. Bleak, shit like that doesn't happen. Bleak, yeah. 
Shit like that happens all the time. Yeah, exactly. Y'all niggas oh, is wilding, yo. This your nigga. man's ex girl just happens to be topping. I mean, that's the scenario ex-girl. that we're making. No, I'm no, saying no, no. shorties. We're not saying, no, 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 no. We're not talking about just random girls some... you're just meeting. We're talking about your man's ex that you just see at a party. Is she yeah. topping you at the party? No, not then and then, <laughs> not at the party. Not she's at the not party. She's not talking you at the party. party. No. Yes, she is. No, she's not. Well, then you ain't got it like that. Wow. <laughs> yeah. If, if that's With consent, of course. With consent, I mean. Let's get back. Yeah, so, uh, so, like, you're, so you're not allowing that. So now are you not friends with this nigga? No, I'm just saying, I'm not saying that, like, yo, if she, if she, if she tops you at the party... <laughs> Oh, Yo, why oh. is that so wild, a commercial for licks? Yo, why is that so wild for your man to get topped off by your ex shorty? Like, y'all ne- Yo, I never understood that. And girls have it even more, like, in their brain. It's like, re- can't say the word retarded, right? Um, it's so, like, different in their mind. They're like, yo, man, I fucked with this nigga. None of y'all can fuck with him. That's so fucking grind, B. Because you're friends with her now, I can't fuck with you because you wanna, one you wanna, time you I mashed you. Like, yo, that shit is crazy. You want to smash into your man's exes? Yo, man, come on. You trying to set me up? I mean, that's, that's what you're, isn't that what you're talking about? Yeah, right? That's exactly what you're talking about. I'm saying, like... I'm saying, like, what if I mean, it's fire? Gonna probably evolve what if it's fire? I mean, it, I, I am talking about a one-time thing, but what if it's fire? Then you're, gr- like, he's grime? Is it not grime if it's a one-time thing? If Why we can't talk about shit like this? Well, we are talking about shit like this. <laughs> <laughs> you, just, you, oh. you just like to say oh, stuff. Uh, yeah. Uh, huh? <laughs> <laughs> you just like to say stuff sometimes. Yeah, right. Why can't we talk about... The, why can't we talk about the topic we're currently talking about? My fault. My fault. I'm a little, I'm a little smack. <laughs> yeah, right? I'm a little smack. But we here. We here. We still here. Yo, but I'm saying, respectfully. Uh-huh. <laughs> I think it's a sketchy situation. That's why people... Why we can't we fuck... Why I can't fuck your friends? You now that we don't fuck with each other no more, about sure. girls? But I don't, like, are you changing? It's a like, sketchy situation. Nobody was talking about, there's no girls sketchy. here to, like, argue against, with you. Like, All right, yeah, I'm bringing that up. Remind me to bring that up. Next next <laughs> right, female. So, so next you, female guest, just so know. I, so do you want to smash any of your man's exes? Yeah, man, it's a sketchy, <laughs> this is a sketchy, <laughs> sketchy situation. That you put yourself nah, in. <laughs> I understand why you want to. Sm- I understand why you would want to smash your ex's friends, but that, but we're, you're talking about your man's. You the situation was your man's ex. Yes. Mm-hmm. So I mean, if we're, if we're like keeping it, it no, in that realm, it's, it's do you ex, want your man? Do you want your man's to to if your ma- if your man's has the opportunity to get the top from your ex at a party that they bump into? Yeah. Do you want him getting the top? It depends what ex it is. Oh, oh. you see. It's case by case. It's a sketchy situation no matter what. It's shifty. It is. Some exes, like, that shit will make still, and I don't, it doesn't make any sense to be tight, right? It doesn't. (laughs) But you shouldn't hold on to it. Feelings were attached, so you're going to be tight. Because it's my man's. Like, damn, my man's. Come on. You don't need that one. There's so many. That one? Yeah. There's some joints that I'm like, hey, man, it's the game, baby. I get it, baby. But there's some joints like yo, damn, nah, come on, not that. So are you, uh, so are you tighter? You see me, you see me. I yeah. cried over that bitch. Don't you ever you, fuck her? Are you tight? Are you tight? Are you tighter, your man? I cried. He's definitely her. tight. You. Don't you ever fuck her? He's I, definitely I cried tight. To you about her? Yeah, you know. You got him. Then I was bitch over her. Don't ever fuck her. You're gonna be tight, man. So, so are you tight to him? Tight. Yeah. yeah, I'm tight to him. Yeah, it's alright though. It's alright. You know how ex, I got. I'm married. The question was if you're married. Yeah, I'm married. I gotta let that go. It don't matter, man. It still that's feels harsh. whack though, but I gotta let it go. DK, we bonded over you. That's you ridiculous. Said, yeah. yeah, we bonded yeah. over you. Would have got Yo, you more tight. That would have been. Yeah, a pelea. No, gave vamos me a top top in the bathroom. Yeah, I must. Like, nah, on. we fighting, my nigga. Nah, her top is crazy. Get the fuck out of here. What if he pulls up to you like, "Yo, I know, I know why you were with her for six years, yo. Her top is." Ridiculous, my nigga. Nah, you was holding out. I don't need you was to, holding yeah. out, my nigga. Yeah, yeah, you was holding out. You was holding out. You hear this shit, my nigga? This yeah, is I'm not nah. disrespectful, this young is nigga G, shit. You was holding G, out, my nigga. Nah, G, you can't say that. G drink is yeah, is super juice today. Oh, so this is super juice. This is not regular G. <laughs> Yeah, you wildin', bro. Off the rails. Seriously. Oh, shit. Off the rails. <laughs> anybody will pull Yo, up off and the slap the shit out of somebody. For real? I mean. What did I do? 
What happened? What, what happened? I don't know. They said I'm wild. You are talking about like, DK, you're not gonna be, you know, that somebody could say that to some, like, that's insane. <laughs> that's a crazy, that's a crazy it's thing insane. to say to somebody. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yo, yo what? what? So call on. somebody up and be like, yo, I smashed your ex and we bonded over you. Yeah. Yo, my nigga, where are you? What? Where are you? Where are yo, you? I know why you, you kept yeah, it like, your girl. Where are you? And that that's it. That was amazing. Who the, who is this who the calling fuck? my phone? You, Who is you this? disrespectful? You like, stole my man's phone? But it's your man, so he you feels like he's coming phone? with love. Nah, so you, yeah, like, you're you're coming you're with love. cutting ties. Whose man's is... Who? Nah, we bonded over that. That's wild. That's not my man. Nah, because yeah. it's like some, some love oh, shit like, yo, my man's, man. you was holding out, like... Yeah. My yeah. man's, yo. You hold it Her out. shit is fire. Yeah, you know. You, oh, you know, nah. Me. Don't come to my place. Tell, tell yeah. me that. Damn. So niggas can't be cool. Yeah. If you send me a text, then I know I can like. So y'all niggas would be mad shit, if your but... man's is digging your ex, like the ex. Hit me up in the comments. No, let me know. I said I, said I wouldn't give a fuck. But you brought it up as like you already are about to wife it. <laughs> Nah, he's about to wife it. You he's was about, about to, to wife it. He's nah, about to wife it. There's mad time that goes between meeting her and like bonding and then building a bond and then wifing. Yeah, yeah and all of that actually. And you, and you want to bring it up to me first time at the wifing stage. Do you, dog? <laughs> like, you don't need me. <laughs> like, what you talking to me So for if now? I come to yeah. you before the wifing stage, it's a different answer? I mean, I mean, it w- don't the come with me with no never going to be you can't date her. Especially like if I'm Yeah, married. so then what's the issue? You're my I'm man. I'm just saying you're coming to me at the end of the at the race or the road and say, "Yo, is this cool?" <laughs> like what? <laughs> It's like you. It's like you say, "Get in the car, let's take a ride," and then no. you tell me at the end that once I'm already in the car, like, "Yo, we're going on a road trip across the country." It's like, "Yo, <laughs> dog." <laughs> tell me at that before I get in the car. I think it's. I'm nothing. gonna say, "Cool, we out, let's I, go." I think it's nothing like that. I mean, bro. I think it's more like. Nah, man. It's the principle. At that point, like what you, the fact that you had to ask me already, you already know you fucked up. So get out of here. <laughs> <laughs> nah, I'm asking you. It's not even like asking you. I'm asking you for your blessing. Like, yo, like, I want you to, are you cool, my nigga? Like, can we, we piecing it up? We cool with this? You just hit me, you just hit my phone talking about, yo, I know why you kept, I know you why you watched it. I tried to start leading with a joke. Because her top was crazy. <laughs> I tried to lead with her a top, joke. Yo, yeah, yo. how you just telling me her top yo, her, was I tried crazy to lead with I was a holding joke. out. Yo, her top was crazy. Yeah, yo, I'm holding I out. I know why you wiped it. Yeah, so bro. I'm about to wife it. Yeah. Right, so no fucking with your exes. No, I I, I didn't say that. <laughs> no, you keep just trying to change. Damn, saying. damn, you I'm really saying. lost one here. Yeah, like yo, bro, yo. It's just the thing I just want to let you know, bro, aggressive. that damn, you really did lose. I'm saying you're coming while late. <laughs> she was you're right. Coming while late. All right. If okay. you if you truly want to get my blessing, you'll come to me when you. Yo, first, yo, get, we'll I really like. All right, I really like your ex. I want to fuck with her. Cool. No, okay. So now I can wild out. Bleak, same thing. What, Bleak, what same calls, thing. No, what if he calls you and he be like, yo, you know what? I agree with her. She was, a, she was, she was the one, bro. She was the one you let go. Huh? You like that? Huh? Why are you talking to me like that? I'm just That's... saying. You're coming up with these wild scenarios. You what want you wild saying? scenarios? No. Here, hold that one. That was mad yeah. disrespectful. That's, like, like, That's exactly how everything like is like that. You like that? I thought you was my man. I, I'm <laughs> your man. But you said these scenarios. Y'all so. slap the shit out of me. Exactly. Yeah, exactly, though. You got to be tight. Got into a trouble with two of your exes. Since <laughs> we making up scenarios, you like that, huh? You you cool with that? Your man's like, yo, I'm about to take down both your last two favorite take exes. Yo, my wow, man, kill that man. <laughs> right, that doesn't sound cool. Right, that don't sound cool. And I will cool, make, right? like make it look like an accident. <laughs> he got sex to death. That's how he told you and shit. And he had a heart attack with all that fucking he was doing. He was taking Viagra's. Viagra. <laughs> and then I also hit him with the ice bullet for good measure. Ice bullet for good measure. <laughs> nah, man. You can't. You got to stay away from the exes. Yo, man, give me some more topics. I'm high as shit. Nah, I got to stay away from the exes. That's a, that's a good one. 2021. Stay away from the exes. The year of the exes. So, fellas, you on, You heard about what's happening uh Casanova right now? Yes. He's currently locked up. Right Casanova now. what? Yeah, Casanova the rapper. <laughs> the rapper, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Casanova oh, the rapper. No way. Okay. This is where we're going. I see it. <laughs> Let's go, man. Oh, my God. I can't believe this. Let's go. This clip is unusable. Nah, this is great. This is a great clip. You, you got to keep the clip. I don't want... Listen. Let's get money. Let's get money. Let's, get money. let's, t- let's dance. Let's dance on this money. Let's go. 
this money. <laughs> Let's dance with this money, bro. Let's get it, baby. Let's get this money. <laughs> Let's go, baby. We got tap. I left <laughs> Earth. <laughs> I've been left Earth. Okay. Yo, let me get Yo, that. it's the blunt exchange, baby. Let me get that, G. You keep it fucking blunt, you heard me? All right, so, um, what else is new? What else is new? What else is new? What else is new in news? Yo, yo, yo. Yo. <laughs> Anything else is new in yo, news? Yeah, so uh, he's currently locked up and facing federal charges and, like, RICO uh, drug charges and, like, gang, like, I mean. Sheesh, that's unfortunate. Stuff. Yeah, like yeah, an 11-year-old uh, investigation wow. and stuff like that. Sheesh, was that like a, he's a kingpin or something? That's what they're claiming. Jeez. Rico charges, that sounds serious. Yeah. Okay. Do you, you ever do you know who uh, Casanova the rapper Casanova is? I mean I heard of him, yes. Yeah. Yeah, he has a song with like Fab. Mm -hmm. uh, he's had a song with like uh, a bunch of other local he's had a song with Future, I believe. Yes. I thought you said you had like news. Oh. Oh yeah, I yeah, guess. Yeah, I thought yeah. we were talking um, about Oh. Okay. So is Kid Cudi? <laughs> we got a question. I got a question from a user. I got okay. a question from. Uh, I got a question from a viewer. Yeah, go ahead. Um, viewer question. We have a viewer question. Uh, the viewer question was: Is Kid Cudi? Nice? <laughs> is Kid Cudi nice? Yes. Oh my God. Yo, Kid Cudi is mad Bleak? nice. Is this, is this question from? <laughs> Bleak? The hey, question is: Is Kid Cudi nice? Yes, I think so. Go ahead, G. I think he is. Is Kid Cudi nice? What do you mean? He's a very nice actor. For real, what do you like him? We made him about music, obviously. Oh, we're talking about music. He's a we're very bad about... shoemaker or shoe designer. Yeah, that shoe wasn't fine. That shoe is I not could, it. I could agree to that. What do you think about his music? Hmm. I don't think very mm -hmm. much of it. Not very much. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he's... Mm -hmm. I'm not, I know that to some people he's a legend. It's mostly... Dweebs, but but hey, do you to each his own? I mean, so I'm a dweeb. I'm, not not a, so I'm a, a dweeb. I mean, when you listen to him, you dweeb out. Dweeb out. What do you mean, dweeb out? He's a dweeb. So like, you he's dweeb, a dweeb. You get into. He's dweeb. not a dweeb. He is. He's not a dweeb. Whatever dweeb okay. means, <laughs> that the feeling that the energy you get from dweeb, that's what Kid Cudi and Kid Cudi niggas are. Just because you don't like his music, you gotta say he's a dweeb. Okay, that's how you see it, and yeah. that's fair. That's a fair analysis. Man on the Moon 3 is fire. I And I hope that you enjoy it every time you I listen to it. I do enjoy it. Y'all yeah, don't even listen to him, so I don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, man. Do you? I, I don't I don't. Did still, you listen? I don't still do coloring books. He doesn't do coloring books. Oh, so I'm good. So, look at that, another heat. Yeah, that sounds insane. More heat. That's a scary album name. Kids He Goes. You like his new album? <laughs> yes, I do like his new album. That's what I just told is, him. Man on the Kid, Moon 3 is, is fire. Is Kid Cudi top five? No, he's not top five. Is he top 10? No, he's Is he top, top 170? Top 170. Is he top 634? Yes. Yeah, he's top 20. Yeah, all right. That's out of control. Okay, that's okay. You can feel like that. I can like name that. 20 niggas from wherever he's from better than Nah, him. Kid Cudi's mad nice. You just don't listen to him. You just yeah, don't listen. Cruising, you don't understand cruising, him. Right? <laughs> just don't listen to the man. He's from Mars or some shit, right? Where's he from? Uh, I don't know. I thought he was from, from some Midwest. Kid Cudi is not nice. He's an emo rapper, <laughs> and that's why he don't like him. It's very simple. It's, it's right, very out there. That's what it is. Out here. What else? What are we talking about? Uh, that's what it is. Uh, He's an emo rappers? rapper. Playboy Cardi. Playboy Cardi. With shit uh, that nobody wanted to talk about. Yeah. Playboy Cardi. I, I don't know. Playboy maybe. Cardi dropped a new album. Any yeah. thoughts on it? I don't think I was high enough. I tried to listen, I listen to, to it. To I got it. to the first two songs, and it was, I don't know, it was like madness. And like I understood what I, maybe I was like yo I think I'm old now, because that sounded like just noise. Mm. It was like mm. a it was like a karate it was like a karate. Di flick. Dinosaur ears like you like to say. Dinosaur ears. Mm. It just sounded like a it was just mad. <laughs> like I'm like yo what is the fuck is going <laughs> like is this shit mixed like yo <laughs> did they yo, mix it? My audio audio engineer you heard the Playboy Cardi shit. Left, you heard the Playboy Cardi shit? Yeah. Mm. There you go. There you go. My man. They didn't listen to it. He's not even listening to yeah. it. Yeah. I'm going to tell you. Our levels no, is good. Yeah, That's all good. that matters. Yeah. 
We good. That's all you need to work. Them niggas is good. good. <laughs> do what I'm you want to do, baby. baby. Let's go. Um, yeah. I was listening to the Cuddy album. That's why I was. I'm just okay, so so music is trash. What it was? Uh, <laughs> music is not trash. Yeah. You're wild. talking about Kid Cuddy and <laughs> yeah, you are. Hell yeah. Some other bum Respect. This is out of Respect. Y'all do New Year's <laughs> resolutions? Everyone starts with New Year resolutions that they don't finish. So yeah, I do. You have a New Year's resolution on hand? What does a resolution mean? Like, you just say some shit? <laughs> yeah, yeah, then I you said, try to I achieve it. I said some shit mad times. That, yeah, you said I a, said mad you said a, a You said a goal. If that's resolution? Okay, then that's you try like setting it. resolutions. Well, nah, I'm up I'm there. Terrible at executing nah, resolutions. Nah, you know what? Right? I'm going to be honest. That I'm not happens. even up there with saying the resolutions. I probably said it a couple of times. Because it's like, what's your resolution? I'm like, uh... <laughs> But if just no one asked me that, money. I didn't have one. It was yeah. just like, oh, this is going to be a fire I'm gonna get day. Money, Let's yeah. go to this That's party and get lit. It's going to be fire. It's a new year, baby. New Where year. the orders? <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. Well, they got the little patty jokes. Yeah, good last year. Man, I'm glad to be back. I mean, we had to take a good break. Because of COVID, but yeah. it's back to be back to, you know, pretty consi- uh, very, very But they consistent. said COVID is coming back again, but now are we just smarter? I don't know. Exactly. Are we just smarter now? So like, Yeah. Gonna, don't worry. Blood Exchange is going to show y'all. Uh, G's going to get the the uh, vaccine live on camera. Oh, you oh, out yeah. your fucking mind. Oh, that's good. Gonna, that's good. Gonna, that's good. Yeah. You see? Yeah, you see how they try to do you? But you see how they try to do you, right? Yeah, we're going to see. We can't wait. Blood Exchange exclusive. I'm excited. We are fucking high as shit. You're a piece of shit. <laughs> see what I did there? Um, yeah. Well, that was a good one. The, thank you. Thank you for coming to the Blood <laughs> Exchange. Nah, nah, nah. What are you doing? Oh, oh, man. Man. You only got that off because you're the host. <laughs> you didn't deserve that laugh. You didn't deserve that laugh. You didn't deserve it. Yeah, they only right. gave it to you because they had to. They felt Let's go. obligated. Thanks for coming to the Blunt Exchange. We'll try to do better next episode. Thanks for pulling up, rolling up, lighting up, keeping the blunt with us. Yeah, man. Shit. Let's get it. We'll see you next week. Yeah.